Hello, and welcome to another TA Tech Tip. In this tech tip, we'll show you how to set up experiments on your X3 DSC. Programming experiments on the X3 DSC is a straightforward process using the TRIOS software package. Within TRIOS, you have the option to set up experiments in the running queue or design view sections of the file manager. To start, select the create new links to create a new empty test. All three sample sensors are enabled by default. If only one or two samples are going to be run, simply uncheck the box next to the sample sensors that will not be used. Next, enter the sample names and pan information into the corresponding fields. Click the Edit Tray Configuration link to set the correct reference pan information. Once complete, click the Close button to be taken back to the experiment form. If desired, data file naming can be modified in this portion of the form as well. Out of the box, TRIOS uses the sample name token when creating data files. For the X3 DSC, this token appends the names for samples A, B, and C as seen here. Additional tokens can be added by clicking the Add Token button and selecting from a list of available tokens. Once the sample information has been set, we can move on to programming the experimental conditions for the test. The test list contains several templates for common DSC experiments that can be used as a starting point. Once loaded, the experimental parameters in the template can be modified as needed. Select the Custom option from the list to build an experiment from scratch. Click the Edit button, then add the required method segments by double-clicking or dragging them into the segment editor. Once complete, click the Apply button. If desired, procedures can be saved for use in future tests. The advanced options allow you to edit the temperature range at which the sample pans will be loaded at the start of a test, the temperature at which to end the test, whether to discard sample pans into the waste bin, and which run-based calibration set to use, if applicable. The analysis and reporting section allows you to apply an analysis template or a report template at the end of a test. Additionally, you may choose to send the analysis results to a control chart. Selecting these options instructs the software to automatically analyze the experimental data based on the information saved in the template files. After creating the first experiment, you can then append additional experiments to the sequence. The append function copies the sample and procedure information to the newly created experiment. If needed, this information can be modified to reflect new samples or test conditions to be run. To execute the experiments that you have just created, press the Start button in the Experiment ribbon. If the sequence was created in the Design queue, first copy the desired experiments to the Running queue, then press Start. In this tech tip, we showed you how to set up experiments on your X3 DSC. Please stay tuned for more helpful tips from TA Instruments, and thank you for your interest.